Hi guys, I'm just going to talk you through the Sims wading staff. Um, one of our most popular items here, um, certainly if you're a river fisherman, regardless of whether you're a trout fisherman or you're a salmon angler, this is certainly something you should have um, as far as your bits of safety equipment goes. Um, this one comes in a neoprene sleeve, um, which has a loop for your belt for your waders, uh, which is great because it means you can just sling it around to your side when you don't need it. Um, and it's collapsible, which is a really important thing. So rather than one that's gonna dangle in the river behind you, if you don't need this, fold it down, pop it inside of the sleeve. So imagine it's on our side here. Um, we're just gonna pull that out from the sleeve. So in this case, I'll just slide it out and you see it drops down straight away. Um, if you pull the main part of the body back up, it sort of locks together in the same sort of style as a, a tent pole does. Um, inside of here, you've got a little button. Once we pull that up, you'll see there's a little sil silver button just pops in that then locks. It's height adjustable, so whether you're a taller person or a shorter person, you can adjust this. And then there's a simple little latch here on the side, which you can pop across and that locks it in place. This one's made of aluminium, so it's very strong, very light. Um, so nice and easy to carry around for a long time. It doesn't have a really heavy weight on it, so it's really good for kind of searching out. It's not gonna make too much noise on the riverbank. And a nice, comfortable, non-slip rubber grip for the handle. A um, couple of accessories you can get for this. You can get a little uh, zinger that goes with it, which attaches onto the, sh the sheath itself. So again, if you drop it by accident, it's not gonna disappear down current. Um, and you can apply quite a bit of pressure onto these. Um, on the end of it, it has a, a small little metal nib on the end, which you can change for a rubber stopper in case you want something that's going to be maybe a little bit more quieter on the river. Um, and then when you decide you don't want it anymore, pop that catch back across, slide it back down, depress that little silver button, extend that cable back out, and it just folds up in a concertina kind of way. And then you can slip it straight back into your sheath, back on with your day's fishing come to another piece of river you might not particularly know, might be a little bit deeper, you just want to search out, or you're trying to cross a, a heavier bit of flow, then again, pop it back out again, pull it down, wait till that button pops back in, lock that over again, and away you go. So if you're looking for a, a wading staff, these are a fantastic piece of kit, really useful that you can just pack it away and out of the way. Um, I've been using one for several years now, I can't really recommend them highly enough.